What's up guys, Kemens here, Pilot509. It's been a while since I've uh, uploaded a video. I wanted to give you guys a little update of, uh, of what I've been working on and what I've been doing. I haven't been doing much flying uh, since the New York trip. Uh, the plane's been down to get some avionics upgrades. Uh, I'm getting ready to start my um, IFR training. So the plane needed some newer avionics. Uh, so I wanted to show you guys exactly what I have, what I have in store, uh, and what's, what's the plan is for the near future, for the next year. Now let me show you what I have. So guys, I installed two AV30s. Therefore, the vacuum pump was removed. In results, I was able to lose some weight. The one on top is, um, is set as an altitude indicator. Uh, of course and the one at the bottom is a directional gyro I'm very very pleased with them the, the numbers are big uh, so you can't miss them you can't mess them and of course I end up keeping uh, the airspeed indicator and uh, the, the altitude the other altitude indicator that's right here that came with the plane and of course the vertical uh, speed so I have um, a nice clean uh, six pack And then guys, I have a 635. It is just like the 650 without the nav function. Uh, I have it uh, slave to uh, the a AV30, the directional gyro. So uh, it shows me, it sends information as such as uh, a speed, a track uh, and everything to the, six, to the AV30. So the 635 is a great platform for IFR. Uh, shoot ILS uh, it's really good I've been very 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 pleased with this 635 and I went and kept I kept the old uh, KX 155 um, it has glide slope uh, component to it so I kept that and of course I got a CDI that is uh, interface with the 635 so basically that's what I have uh, new uh, in the plane 635 and then the two AV30s. At the bottom here, I'm gonna put a turn and bank indicator. Uh, turn and bank indicator is what uh, is what's gonna be next. Uh, I already have it, they, they are not expensive at all. So I'm putting one down there. So well, I'm gonna have a complete, complete uh, panel. And with the units on, this is how they look. This is the AV30. Uh, of course, I have outside a temperature and then um, the airspeed, the indicated airspeed, the bus voltage and the altitude. And of course, the barrel, barrel meter at the bottom of, uh, of the altitude indicator. And then the bottom is the directional gyro. And the 635. When it's on that's how it looks I'm gonna show you guys uh, I did some uh, flight some test flight uh, with them and I'm gonna show you guys exactly how they how they interconnect and how they work together mm -hmm. 